So The Wire is probably the best urban show ever created. But, but, but. Who did you have writing the series? They didn't look like you. You know what? Let's go look. Let's go because I don't want to. I don't want to speak out of turn, out of place. Let's go see the writers for The Wire. Let's see why The Wire was such a great urban series. Who were the writers for the? Let's see. No, no, no. Algo doesn't know. And then they Okay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> This is why The Wire is considered one of the greatest television show series ever. Is this, are you okay with this? Are you okay with this? Are you okay with this? This is, this is, this is where we're at with it right now, y'all. This is where we're at with it. This is where we're at with it. Now, you know, anything HBO does, they put their foot in it. HBO has some of the best series, bar none. You can't really name me a whack series on HBO from HBO. Okay. Five seasons. I would say season five was it was the weakest of uh, out of them all. So other writers included three acclaimed crime fiction writers from outside of Baltimore, George Pelicanos, Richard Price, and Dennis Lehane from Boston. Okay. I'm just saying, are you okay with this? This is where we're at. Omar's are coming. White folk gave you that. Hey, hey. Omar's are coming. White folk gave you that. White folk gave you Omar. One of the greatest villains ever. One of the one of the great one of the most complex villains ever. Even though he was a complete villain, you rooted for Omar. And you were sad when the little kid gunned him down. Ah! They gave you Snoop. And you hit him with the pop back. You know what I'm saying? The trouble is, when you leave that truck for a while, you need to step up and use the bitch. The battery don't hold up, you know? They gave you. Uh, 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 Idris, what was his, what was his, what was his character? Hey, listen, Marlo. Uh, oh my God, yeah, Prop Joe, a uh, brother, Mu, brother Musan, or brother the, the the Muslim brother. Some deep, complex black characters. These characters were intelligent, shrewd, calculating. They were never emasculated. They're all criminals, but they were highly intelligent criminals. Highly intelligent criminals. Yeah, Brother Muzon. Barksdales. You know what I'm saying? Avon. Okay. Okay. String of Bell. Yeah. All deep. Rich, intelligent, captivating, black, urban characters. You'll never see an ensemble of, of black men portrayed in that, in that way ever again. Right? This was basically the, the closest thing you had to a black mafia TV series. And they were all well-written characters. All extremely well-written characters. 
They all had flaws, but they had so many redeeming qualities about them. It was hard to root against them. Marlo came in, you know, when you had a uh, Avon barking at his baby mama, like I can still touch you from here, right? The, the boy was acting a fool. She wanted him to sell dope. He was like, I don't want him to sell dope. You don't think I can't touch you from here? Who the fuck you talking to right here? Remember who I am. My word is still my word. In here, in Baltimore, and in any place you could think of calling home, it'll be my word that finds you. Huh? White folk gave you that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm just saying, it is what it is. I'm just saying. Okay. I'm gonna let that go. I'm gonna let that go. Do you like what 50 got going on with the power? Hell no, bruh. D -d 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 no, it's subpar. When he killed off Ghost, that was lazy writing. Killing off Ghost will forever haunt the power series. I don't care what none of y'all say. Ghost was their cash cow. And them killing off Ghost the way they did, and they want to kind of tease you if he's dead or not. That was some lazy ass writing. It went downhill from there. I don't care about no goddamn Tariq being a drug kingpin. I don't care about what Tariq got going on. I wanted to see Ghost uh, get into political power and navigate the politics. You survived the gangs and the, and, and the drug. And you you, stopped, you survived the drug game. Now what can you what can you do with the politics? I wanted to see that ascension to him, of him. Killing him off was extremely lazy. So now what we're doing? We're back in the streets again. We're back in the streets, drug peddling, fighting for for scraps. We're back to drug dealers now. You could have had a, a huge chance, a huge a huge misstep and not letting ghost achieve his full potential lazy ass writing lazy as fudge okay now, i'll say this bmf is probably the, the strongest of them all raising canaan it's between Raising Canaan and, 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 and BMF. And I really don't care for either one of them, but I'm just, I'm like, fuck it, they black, I'm gonna support it. You know what I'm saying? Let me support. I'm only supporting out of allegiance, some blind allegiance to melanin, to my to skin complexion. I'm not watching because it's good. I'm not watching because I care what happens next. I'm watching out of blind allegiance. At least I can admit that part. I'm watching because they're black. That's it. Just like how everybody voted for Obama. Cause he's because he's big. That's why. It's, it's not it's not even that deep. Not even that deep. Hmm.